war between Russia and Ukraine is getting really out of hand from the moment it started basically and a lot of people suffer from that and today we're going to take a look at a project that's anticipating on that because a lot of people need help and there are a lot of projects out there in crypto but non-crypto related as well that do some great charity stuff and i feel like dude this project right here deserves it all man and if we can help a little bit and make a little money ourselves then that's great so let's take the money from the rich from the bad traders put it into our pockets and put it into the pockets of the people that actually need it so with that being said welcome to FOMOTION my name is Menno and if you slowly want to FOMO into crypto the right way and actually help people then this is the right video for you so don't forget to subscribe to the channel for the low caps and the early gems in crypto if you keep watching the video someone I'm gonna ask you a question you can win $20 worth of BNB just leave the right comment about it today we are going to take a look at love Ukraine so this is the project and I'm not asking you to donate I'm asking you to pay attention to this video research the project and if you have some spare change this is not financial advice but you might want to invest some because a lot of it is going actually to the people that need it and a part is also going to you as a holder apart from the fact that you're buying into something with a very low market cap and the whole world is paying attention to this so that's something that I really like I can appreciate it a lot so what's up with this project it's just new um, I know a lot of people feel like fuck the world I'm not gonna do charity also fine let's be super super self self-centric and how you call that it's a low cap project that you can make a lot of money off. So <laughs> that as well. So let's take a look at the website, what it is. All the links are in the description of the video. Check it out. Crypto World supports Ukraine. We offer free transport, food, accommodation, and support. If help is required, please contact us at this at this number or our official email address, right? So they're already out there like, okay, call us, email us if you need us. I like that, right? Join our Telegram. We're gonna take a look at that in a while, but first let's take a look at the project. What is it doing exactly? Exactly, and how is it not only benefiting the people right there but how it may also benefit you because there are a lot of people in crypto that just want to make money and of course I'm one of these guys but there are also a lot of people in crypto that in crypto because they really need money and this might be the only way so let's take a look what is this well what does war mean to people it means loss it means suffering it means helplessness but often means you have to give up give up on everything to give up everything you get it for a lifetime, friends and the places where you were born. Since Russia's invasion to Ukraine on Thursday, roughly 120,000 Ukrainians fled their country. US officials have estimated that the Russian invasion could produce between one and five million refugees. Can you imagine that that shit is fucked up? So what are these guys trying to do? The purpose of them, Love Ukraine's goal is to help people of Ukraine who have fled from the war, to arrive in a foraging country with family, children, and sometimes pets. And it's already fucked up enough. So if you at least enter another country, let's make it so good as we can for these guys. And I'm not gonna read you the whole website. Links are in the description of the video. Go check it out for yourself. But just to give you a little idea how they are going to do it, part of the development team from Romania will travel to the border between Ukraine and Romania, where it will provide direct aid to refugees consisting of food, accommodation, and legal assistance and deployment opportunity, and employment, sorry, opportunity opportunities right so the team part of the development team from Romania so these guys live near right so they are like a little more involved than for example I am because I'm not facing it from you know a couple of miles away so they're not only donating to charity funds they're actually doing it themselves and I I, I don't know man I love these guys I love these guys now check out this short clip of their work, man, um, to get a bit of picture of the whole, you know, get an idea of this all, man. Look at this. I think some people might be in some kind of denial, not maybe denial, but just don't know how serious shit is. As you can see, they actually have their own buses and everything. Like check this out for yourself but can you imagine where you live 
You have to step on the bus with your kids to leave for maybe forever. I can really, I can't imagine that. So how they are going to do it, here's their roadmap. Uh, let's take a quick look at the roadmap on what they did and what they are going to do. So the first phase, they are going to create a website, social media, marketing partnerships, fair lunch and pink sale, uh, the pancake swap lunch, human, huh? humanitarian, ten, uh, whatever, tents in order to provide food, pets, food, sleeping bags and hot drinks at borders crossing from UK, uh, Ukraine and Romania, donating, providing legal assistance to refugees, providing medium-term accommodations for ref refugees. So, like I said, it's not some guy behind his computer raising money and donating it. This is actually a team that uh, feels like, okay, we are actually going to do something and let's make a token to get the funds to actually do something more. Um, then when it comes to the token though, phase four, that's where we are right now, some, you know, give or take. They want to reach a certain amount of holders, coin market cap and coin gecko listing, and phase five, DEX listings. Um, they are already out on the DEX. Maybe they may mean CEX, like centralized exchange, or other DEXs. I have no idea, by the way, but man, it's, it's good, man. This button purchase now doesn't work yet at the moment of recording. Might be when uh, you're watching the video because it just redirects you to pancake swap. But I'm gonna show you how to buy this token if you feel like, okay, I want to one, help people, but two, step into a micro cap project that might be very interesting for the complete world. So it helps you and them. So a little about the tokenomics, there's 12% fees, 4.8% will be used for charity and for the uh, re revealed purpose of love Ukraine. All right, so that, that's quite a lot though, and I respect that. 4% is redirected to the marketing, 1.2% goes to the holders actually, and that's something that's really, really, really interesting. And I'm gonna show you in a while why I am, uh, why I don't just love the project, but I'm also bullish on it for our own purpose. 1% is getting burned, buyback, and 1% full-time employees uh, to, you know, to, to, to help their people. So they have a lot of videos on their website. They have a lot of photos on the website to give you an impression. You can check it out for yourself. And they got the news right here. Little FAQ, how to buy it, download the app, blah, blah, blah. Here is actually the contract address, all right? So you can just copy this contract address right here, and then you can go to PancakeSwap and actually buy the token. So if we copy the contract, contract address and we paste it right here then we have uh, the contract address and it has to load for oh sorry we have to get rid of this right here then we have the contract address and here you can import the token a i d u a that's the ticker for the token so that's how you actually buy it let me buy a little bit by the way first connect my wallet here so basically how you buy it is you send, uh, select the amount of bnb this is what you get you have to round it up, always round it up, so you can leave the slippage low. Then you can swap it and you can just confirm it and it's all good, you can get it uh, for just like that. You don't have to pay any crazy fees, you just get a little less tokens than this and that's understandable because it goes to the charity, goes to the marketing, goes to the holders and all that kind of stuff. Now that we have con uh, copied the contract address, <clears throat> let me go to uh, PuCoin and Binance Smart Chain Scan to show you why this is for an investor also very interesting. Let me paste it right here because they do not have a lot of following yet. If we take a look at this, they have 428 addresses that are holding the token. And if we look at the chart, this is the chart for the $50,000 market cap, which is extremely micro cap. Now, with the whole world watching Ukraine and Russia, with the whole world knowing about crypto, it's just a matter of the whole world knows about the combination of those two. Then I feel like, dude, at least a $5 million market cap. I might, it might take a while, it might take a little marketing and promotion, all that kind of stuff, but then that's very doable. I've seen a lot of charity projects with a way, way, way higher market cap for a you know less urgent purpose than this one. So with that being said, I think as an investor, I'm not saying it will happen, but 100X is definitely on the table if they approach it right. Apart from that, like I said, you also get a small amount of reflections i thought i said like it was 1.2 uh, percent now that reflections are based on the volume 
And as you can see with this low market cap, there is no volume at the moment. Take a look at that. That's the volume of today so far. So that's not a lot. But can you imagine all these people stepping into this project and it shoots up and you are already there and taking all these reflections and you do not have to share it with a lot of people yet. Then there is so much in for you as well. And that's important because a lot of people feel like, okay, I want to do some charity, but is that really a reason for me to buy a token? Why should I just not donate it? Well, of course, you want to make some money yourself as well. So this is a really good idea if you want to approach it like that. So uh, definitely, you know, just check it out at least. This is their Telegram group. And what I really, really, really like is that they have 759 members. If we scroll through the group, you'll see that it's quite, you know, it's not super, 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 super active, but it has not even a thousand uh, members right here, right? But people are talking quite a lot still here. Now we are at 15 March. That's yesterday from the moment of recording at least. So I have to scroll quite a bit before I see the day before. It means people are talking quite a lot in here for the amount of members that they have in the group. And that's good because it is active. I've seen way bigger groups with less talking. And that's a good thing because people are active in here. People stand behind the project. People are talking a lot. And that means the project is alive. Always, if you check out a project and also this one, check out the pinned messages. Organizing Love Ukraine's second transport to München, Germany. Look, they actually, that, wow, right? I mean, I love these guys. I love these guys. So another pinned message. Love Ukraine is the only token providing direct help to the, uh, at the borders of Ukraine and also in Ukraine. And you have a lot of information right here. So check that out. Legit developers team, team broadcasting live from Ukraine, real help, uh, help for refugees, influences on board, partnerships with human, I can pronounce that, but this. They have AMAs coming. There was an AMA. Well, for me, it's today, but the, pro the, the video is coming out later. But with Root, Root, Roots Clownch, I don't know how to pronounce that, man. I'm Dutch, I can pronounce anything. <laughs> but they just keep on posting the shit that they are doing, man. So, uh, yeah, I, 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 if you do not like this project, I, I honestly don't know what's wrong with you, sorry, man. Little side note, the team are also the developers of Aether, if I pronounce that right now. So that's what they also do. Cool thing is with Aether, they already listed on CoinMarketCap and CoinGecko, so they know how to do that. So I have a lot of confidence in the fact that they will do it with Love Ukraine as well. And this project has a decent $700,000 market cap. So can you imagine what happens with a project like Love Ukraine? That's it for today, guys. How many videos do I have on my YouTube channel? If you can answer that, then leave a comment and you can win $20 worth of BNB. Like the video if you like the video and if you like the project, leave an opinion with whatever. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done already and definitely check this project out with all the links in the description. If you are going to invest, invest safe, do your research, definitely check it out and see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.